All right, we're going to talk about meeting scheduling in Outlook 2007. Uh, the first thing we want to do is you know, we got we have to have an issue. We got to have a meeting. Um, say we just need to get together. We're going to have a uh, a meeting as as a group of teachers, or you know, I need to I just need to visit with the superintendent for a reason, or maybe my principal. Um, and, and so. Uh, you know, I, I talked with the teacher, or maybe you have, haven't even talked with the person about about having a meeting. Um, maybe you're going to email them about having a meeting. So rather than send them an email, say, "Hey, I need to just visit with you," maybe it'll be easier actually to go into your calendar and create, set up a meeting time with them, and give them an option to send back and um, and say, "This is a great time. This would be a better time for me in the meeting." And, and then and then it's actually in your calendar, so you know what's happening when it's happening and then you'll be reminded that it's happening uh, so let's go about it do this let's 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 I'm gonna say we'll just set up an instant where I am going to set up a meeting with a superintendent I need to visit with her about um, um, just this issue of of meetings that I've got to have with her all the time for or I don't know whatever anyways so the first thing we're gonna do is just gonna come up here um, I can I can click this little the little down arrow here, um, and and say uh, meeting say new meeting request, or or I can click new, and that'll bring up the, this box um, to create a new new appointment new new meeting. Um, that's one way to do it. Before I go on and show you exactly how to to set up the meeting and, and schedule a meeting with with another person or group of people. Uh, let's show you how the other way is to to set up a new appointment. If if I need to have an appointment, say later this afternoon, or let's let's just choose. Let's let's go down to next week um, and set up a meeting on this on the seventh. I have a meeting at eight thirty. You see here, but uh, let's let's set up an appointment. So I can, if I double click on this date, I can I can it'll pull up that uh, that uh, that appointment um, box as well. And so I can set up in here my meeting with the superintendent. And first thing I'll do is just I've got to have a subject so she knows what's going on. Meeting about meetings, right? And the location, best place for for her is probably the district office, and it works for me too because I'm I'm available um, as well. So I can I can choose you know so right here we see start time is Tuesday the seventh of October at eight a.m. You know what? Um, nine o'clock is going to be best time for me, and we'll see. This might not be the best time for her either, but nine to nine thirty is going to be best time for me. We'll hop over here to scheduling up here, and we can now see my schedule. <laughs> nine thirty actually won't work for me because, as you see here, um, this blue section is I have a meeting, and and we can see that it's a support cabinet meeting, and it's at the district office for me. Um, so nine thirty is not going to work for me. Why don't I just go ahead and we can see I'm a, one of the attendees in this meeting. I can add other attendees by clicking Add Others from my address book. Like I said, I was going to have this meeting with, with my superintendent. So I can, and it's she's required to be in attendance, so I'm going to click Required. Um, I also, it might be about budget stuff. So I'm going to invite my visits manager, and you know, if it's not required that she be there, but it might be helpful. So I'm going to say optional, so that she's aware of the meeting, and if she's she's available to attend, she can she can say she'll be there. So there we have. I've invited Heather and Kathy to this meeting, and now I can see, oh, they're going to be at that meeting too. Um, so we can see kind of their schedules. This is this is their entire day. Um, you can see Heather. Later on in the afternoon, she has something else going on. You can see, like you can see, like when I hover over, hover over my meeting, it tells me what's happening for me. But if I hover over it for Heather and and for Kathy, I can't see what they're doing, but I can see that they're they're busy. Also, if you if you look, Kathy's colored a little differently. Um, down here is kind of our our um, key. So, the you know this color is busy. This is a tentative. This is just an out of office, um, unavailable, or it's outside of working hours. Um, so Kathy is she's tentative to be there. Here I have Heather is busy at that time, right? So let's find a time that works best for us. Um, you can see here, 
everybody's available during this time frame so maybe 10 o'clock or 10 30 would be better and we can come down here and see set up that start time and end time like we did on that other page on the appointment page so start time 7 to 10 30 to 11 o'clock just with Heather and Kathy um, I can go back to here and if I want to talk about you know uh, you know what we need to have a meeting of uh, I can't type about meetings right and I'll come to your office let me know if this time will work okay so send that because I don't really have to have this meeting I'm going to remove these guys from this meeting and I'm going to send it to myself so let's send that hopefully I didn't send it to everybody in the world great I just got a meeting about meetings in my inbox so if I hop up here to mail um, we can see there's no response required for me up here um, if this was Heather or Kathy would say uh, please respond you know uh, about you know say confirmed not it would also give me an option to change the meeting time you can see that I can click in calendar and can see that meeting in here meeting about meetings here boom great so it's accepted I got the meeting set in my in my oops, excuse me con calendar um, I have the meeting set I'll be reminded about it beforehand so that's how uh, we set up meeting events um, hope that helps and have a wonderful day.